Like Rembrandt and Goya, Vincent van Gogh often used himself as a model. He produced over 43 self-portraits, paintings or drawings in 10 years. Like the old masters, he observed himself critically in a mirror. Painting oneself is not an innocuous act, it is a questioning which often leads to an identity crisis. Thus he wrote to his sister, I am looking for a deeper likeness than that obtained by a photographer. In this head and shoulders view, the artist is wearing a suit and not the pea jacket he usually worked in. Attention is focused on the face. His features are hard and emaciated, his green-rimmed eyes seem intransigent and anxious. The dominant color, a mix of absinthe green and pale turquoise finds a counterpoint in its complementary color, the fiery orange of the beard and hair. Vincent van Gogh is born in the Dutch town of Zundert in 1853. His brother Theo recommends he tries to do something in the arts, so Vincent applies to the Brussels Art Academy. He moves back to Brabant, then to The Hague, Drenthe, Nunen, Antwerp. It seems Vincent can't find his way, or even a job, so every now and then Theo sends him some pocket money. When he joins his brother in Paris, Vincent is introduced to modern painters. His work becomes ever brighter, with vivid colors and short brush strokes. He moves to Arles and paints his heart out. In fact, he makes five versions of the sunflowers, even though he can't even sell the first one. Vincent is not an easy man, for others or for himself. He gets confused and cuts off a piece of his ear. Well, at least it makes for an interesting self-portrait. He has himself admitted to a clinic and continues to paint, even though at times he eats his own paint out of madness. Bon appétit. At the age of 37, life becomes too much for Vincent to bear. After his death, his work finally finds a claim, and Vincent gets the appreciation which, until then, he only got from Theo. Vincent van Gogh, born March 30, 1853, Zundert, Netherlands, died July 29, 1890, Auvers-sur-Oise, near Paris, France, Dutch painter, generally considered the greatest after Rembrandt van Riem, and one of the greatest of the post-impressionists.